What's up everybody, it is your boy Totally Rico back with another video playing some Rocket League. Life is Roblox. Life is Rocket League. No, today I just want to talk about some, some life advice in general. Things that I think of during my life that you may also nicely think of during your life, yes. So first of all, what I want to say is find what you like to do. Life is too short to be wasting it away. I'm not saying that should be your main thing, find a, find a balance you're happy with. I'm not saying, like, for me, to make a content is, is my passion, right? I love doing this. Um, but my money comes mainly through trading, for example. Uh, so, like, it's not like... Nice. It's not like, ma don't make a passion your job per se, that's not necessary. If you don't want to, you know. Um, but focus on at least spending some quality time on what you feel like you want to spend time on. There was a time I used to work like six days a week. And it wasn't that bad. Six, seven days a week. It wasn't that bad. Um, you just burn out way quicker, right? But make sure like you spend some of your week doing some shit you feel passionate about. Your shit, some shit you actually love doing, you know. For me, that's just these videos, for example. I spend a good amount of my week just uh, not doing too much per se, but I make sure that I want I spend some time uh, making these videos. I want to make sure that I spend some time doing what I feel passionate about, right? But make sure your your main passion is also a big focal point of your life. Um, d like, don't just waste away doing some shit that pays good, but you don't feel passionate about, right? There's always a good reason to go do what you love. Um, I've been watching a lot of the Urban Rescue Ranch, um, and his little story of like how he started and shit is, is very interesting. Um, since he, a couple years ago, he was nowhere near where he is now, right? He didn't even know some of his animals, that, he didn't even know like Rhea existed, that type of shit. Man, I wouldn't either if it was for his channel, not gonna lie. Um, oh no! Darn it, we can win this one though. Um, but find what you're passionate about and then just keep doing that. And focus on doing it better. If you're passionate about something, there's always a point in trying to improve that skill. Um, but for example, me making videos. I love doing this. Um, so I want to do it a lot so I get better at it, right? So I'm a bit more trained once I actually start want to make, start making the, the shit that I, I want to move towards, right? This is just a way to keep my skills on point, my little talkative skills, but also a little editing, a little whatever I feel like doing, right? I'm passionate about making videos, so I try to do it as much as I can. Um, and focus on doing it better. Focus on learning with every... If you're really passionate about something, you will do whatever it takes to get better doing it, right? Um, so that's pretty much what I'm up to. And I think you should too. I think that's a good life recommendation. Uh, find what you love to do. That's about it. Like, that's what I wanted to talk about. I think this is uh, the game one. So, GG's. Let's get into the next one. Care for people who care for you. Um, be picky with the people you end up having around you. Um, a bad friendship isn't just, just isn't worth the time. If you're not both uplifting each other, if you're not getting the best out of each other, um, it's not per se the best investment of your time, right? Uh, so don't don't need to feel don't feel the need to put effort into friendships you really don't want to keep want to maintain so make sure you keep the right people close um, and be picked with who you're friends with like don't just do it because you guys know each other for years i have some friends that i've known for years but the reason we stick together is because we also like have a good combination on a personal level um i'm not just gonna stay friends with people because i knew them back then so now i know them now right I think that's just a bad mentality to have in a friendship. I don't think uh, you should stay close to people you don't want to be close to. If you guys are not getting the best out of each other, then stop trying to get the best of each other.
Oh, I wanted to demo him. Fuck. Team, I didn't have that. God darn it. But find people you can help each other, right? Find people that have mutual interest as you. You don't need to be doing the same shit. Since that can end up being kind of a clash. Uh, of or a conflict of interest, I guess. Um, but find people that want, uh, that are able to like critique you in a in a nice way, right? You don't want somebody that's down talking you all the time. You want some positive reinforcement, but also find someone with a realistic uh, perspective on on what you're doing and advice, right? Um, realistic advice and a realistic perspective um, that you can just talk with and run through at this with. The friends I have now aren't. Um, only to, to making videos, but they are have all been around the platform. They do know a bunch about me and what I'm making, I guess. Uh, fuck, that was so bad. I'm, I'm sucking cock. Um, we have different interests and we have different passions, but we can always talk to each other about the direction we're going in. And I think that's very. Uh, very nice. Let's go! What a nice own goal. So be picky with what friends you get and what friends you want to keep. And as you change as a person, don't be scared to fall out of contact with people. You don't need to stay in contact with people. It's not a must for the rest of your life. Um, if you are just... If you're noticing that you're not really going on the same... Or if you notice that you kind of started clashing with some friends, it's not worth it to keep it going, right? Um, or if you don't feel like you are valued enough or something like that. Um, it's not worth your time to just be in a... To spend your time on a friendship you don't like. Let's get into the next game. My last little tip is upgrade your life wherever you seem fit. Um, upgrade can be anything. Uh, it can be maybe a new PC is like an upgrade, right? But also on personal levels. Uh, I've been hitting the gym more. That's a little upgrade. Doing those little things can do a lot for you. And don't overcomplicate it. I myself have like the tendency to be like, okay, but I'm not doing everything that a bodybuilder should. I'm not fucking bulking the max out. I'm not living the healthiest. But that doesn't really matter. Because going to the gym is just such a brain clearer. And it's good for you physically, of course. But also mentally. Um, so don't be like, oh shit, I need to drink five protein shakes a day, need these supplements, I need this and that. Nah, just it's a little upgrade to your life. Um, and that's really all that matters, right? Um, but the same goes for reading, for example. Uh, I'm not the best reader, I read pretty fucking slow. Um... But I do have like books I enjoy and I don't read them all. I, I try, I'm not like, okay, one book every month. I don't like doing that. Um, it's just that lately I've kind of lost motivation to read. So I got a new book about band books. Um, just to read in between all these self-help books I'm reading. Like these kind of upgrading books, right? Um, these books are like, okay, this is how to win friends and influence people. Great read, go read that. Or, or the online marketing tornado, a Dutch book about online marketing. Shit, shit like that, you know. Um, you don't need to be fucking Mr. Reader 5 Master. Mr. Reader Master 5000. Um, just reading a couple times a week already goes a long way. Even a couple times a month, you know. Um, it's just very like nice to read and to gym, for example. But this can also be financially. Uh, upgrade your life financially. For me, I, I'm investing mainly in different, uh, in a different portfolio since uh, I have more money laying around than uh, than I can invest. I guess. Ah, oh, if only I got a little dunk. Like I could invest it all in, in certain like companies and shit, or in one company and try to make it big with that. Um, but that just isn't smart from a, a savings perspective. Um, so I just have a mostly in dividends. And the dividends pay out pretty regularly, almost like every day. And every day I make enough to have some dinner and and, and maybe like uh, get, catch a movie sometimes. Um, 
like getting them like, like that's a tiny little upgrade right instead of just having my savings laying around i put it into different stocks by the different experiment he has like a little pie on trading tool and two i use um and it's a small little upgrade it makes sure i have some passive income uh on top of the savings that i have so i don't have to go through my savings uh i can just live on that little fucking income right um uh, so yeah, like upgrade your life in, in whatever way you seem fit. Uh, no! Uh, like even drinking water can be a small little upgrade. I used to drink way more soda and drinking water just leveled out my energy levels a bit more. Um, so, so I have more energy. Like small little upgrades like that already go a long way. Is that it? No. Beautiful. One more go and we're back in it. Bad kickoff for us. Darn it. Two goals. It's doable though. It's doable. Okay. This is looking less and less likely. Yeah, let's forfeit. I'm going to leave it there. Thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe all that stuff and let's check out what rank we got diamond two division one we're one division down hush darn it but we'll get back up um thanks for watching bye bye